Number 14, number 13, number 12, number 11, number 10, number 9, number 8, number 7, number 6, number 5, number 4, number 3, number 2, number 1. Unsigned bands, pro wrestlers, you've come to the right place. The Jiggy Jaguar Experience. The Jiggy Jaguar Experience. Live to Kelsey Hickman. She is going to be joining us here via the magic of the old Skip Skype. Yes, the Skyper Rooney. And we have got Kelsey Hickman with us. Kelsey, welcome to the big broadcast, the Jiggy Jaguar experience. How are you, my friend? How are you? I'm so good. So you are fantastic. Talk to me a little bit about how you got Thank started you. doing the music thing. Well, let's see. I'm originally from a small town called Sherman, Illinois. And, you know, growing up, I've always been, you know, that little girl singing. But um, I actually joined a band when I was about 16 years old. And I didn't even know that was something that I wanted to do. But once it kind of just happened and popped into my life, I was like, oh, here we go. Found out what I'm supposed to do for a living. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I was in a band from about 16 to 21. And we traveled throughout the Midwest and got to open up for some big names at a young, and I was only 16, you know, young at the time. So I got to get a pretty good resume under my belt. And then after that, I just kind of picked up and moved to Nashville and didn't even know really what Nashville was about, honestly. But I think I figured out, I figured some of it out and that's why I'm here right now. <laughs> that's awesome. Kelsey Hickman with us today. She has released a brand new track, which we are going to play here in just a few moments. Uh, so, Kelsey, how did you get yeah. in to uh, doing some of the things that you're doing with your music and, and being a bigger deal than you were? Well, let's see. I, I mean, coming to Nashville is definitely overwhelming because you just don't know. You don't know where you're supposed to go. And. I immediately went to Broadway to make a living because, you know, that's how I wanted to pay my bills. I didn't want to become a waitress or a bartender or anything like that. Like, I wanted to continue playing music. So I did that. And once I stumbled there, I just kind of did some research, you know, met a couple producers. I worked with um, Kent Wells. He's my first producer that I worked with and put out an EP right away because I was like, okay, I'm here. Let's do some, let's make some music and put out some songs. So I did that. And, you know, looking back, I'm so thankful that I did that because, you know, it's kind of formed me into who I am today when it comes to the journey I've been on. So I did that. And then, you know, I took a break for a while because I just really didn't know who I was as an artist. I, to be honest, um, 2020 really helped me out a lot. It really opened my eyes to what I wanted to say in my music and who I was and what I wanted to put out there. So as Honestly, I'm thankful for 2020, even though it was a total train wreck. <laughs> but um, we, I, I really got to hone in on what I, who I am, and I just kind of realized that you know, I got that country heart. That's where I, where I was raised, how I was raised, my family. But at the same time, I got like this sassy. I've always been this sassy girl. I've always had this sassy attitude, and you know, the older I get, it's this rock and roll attitude that I got. So. And that definitely portrays on stage as well. Like, I'm a performer at heart. So whenever I'm on stage, like, I just, I've always been very energetic, rocking out with the songs. And so I think the music that I have came up with um, in the past couple of years is, like, really going to represent me well. And I am so excited about it. <laughs> That's awesome. So Kelsey Hickman is with us today. Novocaine is the latest from her. So tell me a little bit about Novocaine, and then we're going to play it here in a few moments. Let's see, Novocaine came about, I was actually going to write with this producer named Don Miggs, and like I said, when I took some time off, uh, writing for me was, it's just such a vulnerable space, and I was just having trouble finding the right people to click with, and when I came in there, I told him that, 
you know, I've been I've been very transparent on my journey and who I am, and I'm not here to play any games or be fake or try to be someone that I'm not. And you know, he said he goes well. He's like, well, that's not right today. He goes, let's look at some songs. <laughs> I'm like, okay. So Nova came popped up, and it was actually originally a male vocal piano ballad. But when I heard the words, I was like, oh my god, I have to sing this song. Bless you. Excuse you. <laughs> The, um, I have to sing the song. And as soon yes. as he said that, he's like, yes, you do. So he, we just redid it. Obviously, it's this rock country power ballad, like, you know, just kicks you in the teeth. It's got this dramatic build. It's this, you know, this toxic love song that I'm just obsessed with. And I'm so glad I, that I got to sing it. Nick Brown, Dietrich Clark, and Don Miggs are the ones that wrote it. But my fingerprints are all over this baby. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, we are going to do this. We are going to go to the track. I'm going to go ahead and put you on a brief hold okay. here on Skype, and uh, we are going to play the song when we come back. We will have more with Kelsey Hickman. She joins us live here on our big program, and uh, we are going to go to Novocaine, which is the latest from her, and she joins us here on our big, big broadcast, Coast to Coast. Border to Border on iHeartRadio today. And, of course, uh, she is tremendous. It is Nova Kane, and uh, we are going to go to it. I know all love is a loaded gun. If I'm afraid to hold it, where is the fun? Then you pulled your hammer back and shot me. Now I'm in the dirt with blood on my shirt You ain't there to ask me where does it hurt Do you know what it's like to love you? It's so That is Kelsey Hickman. It is Nova Kane. It is here on your Sunday radio program, the Jiggy Jaguar Experience, each and every Sunday on 990 WBOB out there in Rhode Island, of all places. And of course, you can find us on the mix on Tuesdays. And uh, Kelsey Hickman back with us here on our big, big broadcast. 
So, what what are, what are some of your uh, some of your plans coming up with the summer and and everywhere else? Um, you know, I'm just gonna. I have a, a lot of music to release this, this year that I'm really excited for. Like I said, this I've never been more happy to release some music. I just feel like it represents me perfectly, and I can just I'm so excited to play them live. Um, actually, I'll be go. I'll be leaving next Thursday. I'm going to be at the Blue Strawberry in St. Louis, Missouri, on Thursday the thirtieth, uh, and then I will be at Feinstein's in Carmine, Carmel, Indiana, on the thirty first. So, those will be the two shows that I actually get to play some of my stuff live. That um, that you'll be able to get tickets to. So look those up: Feinstein's in Carmel, Indiana, and the Blue Strawberry in St. Louis. So I'm really excited to see everyone's reaction. You get to if you do come to my shows this year, you will be hearing some songs that aren't released yet. So I'm gonna get to give you guys a little taste of what I've been working on, and I'm ready just to rock out with you guys. I'm ready to just give it to you. Fantastic, Kelsey Hickman with us today. So before we let you go, Kelsey, how do we get in touch with you online and social media and everywhere else? So just Kelsey Hickman Music, K E L S E Y. And, um, yeah, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, the whole TikTok thing. I mean, I'm on there, and I'm figuring it out, hell. You know, I'm just trying to get that TikTok down. So <laughs> go ahead and follow me on there, and you can see me um, try to make videos and make uh, an idiot of myself on TikTok. Let's, let's just go there. Definitely follow me on there. <laughs> but, yeah, awesome. I appreciate all the support. Y'all message me. If you're ever in Nashville, hit me up. Um, I play down on Broadway whenever I'm not on the road. So I'd love to have any of you guys at my shows. Fantastic. Kelsey Hickman with us today. She's got Nova Kane, and that is the latest from her. We heard that earlier. And uh, thank yeah. you for joining us, and uh, we will talk to you soon. Appreciate it, my friend. Thank you guys very much. Appreciate it. There she goes. That's Kelsey Hickman with us today. We are going to go to Monica Rose uh, after.